Yeah, so what's up today? How y'all feeling out there? Hopefully y'all is good with you. And I'm back to, uh, you know, talk about my journey, you know, or should I say my adventure, my experience and my journey, you know, with the GM and UAW. But like I said, I started in 2004, which was 21604, my seniority day. That's February 16, 2004, is when I started with GM at the Fairfax plant in Kansas City, Kansas, home of Local 31. But um, I just wanted to speak on like how it was, you know, first stepping through them doors and you know, not knowing what to expect. Uh, yes, as a child, I took, you know, tours through there. You know, my father did 30 years, uh, shout out to him. But like I said, I did the tours through there and, you know, it's nothing like going through there as a child and then walking in there as an adult and being an employee or a union member like that. So, as uh, I was going through training for the first two weeks. And our training was during the day. It was first shift. You had to be there, I believe at 6.30, 6.30 to 2.30. And I just came from a job where I was going in at noon and getting off at like four in the morning, you know? So that was like a real crazy change for me. And I always, before work mid shift jobs, uh, you know, 11 to eight, or, you know, like I said, I go in at noon, I work for a medical products uh, plant and, uh, or I'm sorry, warehouse beforehand. And uh, I had this shift where I was going in at noon and getting off like basically whenever they said, because we supplied hospitals at the time. But uh, anyway, fast forwarding, so I'm doing my two weeks and uh, I never forget. So my father comes to me and says, hey, you wanna go to the UMKC game? This was on Thursday night. And I'm like, oh yeah. He's like, you sure? You sure you're gonna be good? You sure you're gonna be good for uh, you know tomorrow cause you gotta be there at six o'clock. And I'm like, yeah, yeah, I'll be good. So I go to the game and uh, had a good time and uh, wake up Friday. And I hit the clock at 6.01, I think, or 6.02. So they called me in this room after we got done with, I believe they were speaking to us in the morning. By that time, we were already upstairs with the, uh, they had like these wood cars. It was a makeshift line, assembly line uh, with these cars made out of wood. And we were getting ready to go in there. But before we went in there, they called me in this little room. So they got me sitting in this room. It's like going into like interrogation or something, right? So these two uh, foremen, I guess, or, you know, high up uh, people on the management side come in and they like, hey, are you gonna be able to handle this? Like, we don't mess around with people being late like that and all this. And I'm thinking I'm gonna get fired on the last day of training. The last day of training, I'm thinking I'm gonna get fired. But basically I go through the whole thing because Monday I was starting at, uh, I believe it was 3.30 we started when I first started working, working there. Uh, and that Monday I was going to be working on second shift. And I knew I could, you know, manage that because I was used to working second shift. So that went by and that Monday I was in there on second shift and uh, it blew my mind, you know, but I was able to hold it down and uh, do my thing, you know. Uh, and this uh, will continue on the next video, but I just wanted to give y'all a start, you know, and, and let y'all know, you know, my seniority day when I started and how it started, because that kind of freaked me out. I did think I was going to get fired. 
but uh i'll be back with y'all i'll be back with y'all with another video you know uh tomorrow maybe or maybe the next day uh i'm not for sure if i'm gonna be doing this every day that's why i said periodically i'll be giving y'all videos but uh hopefully you enjoy this content that i'm giving you about my adventure experience and journey with uh gm slash uaw peace